Welcome back to Let's Play Sonic Adventure 2, episode 26. We're back to having fun now, so it's okay. Oh, thank we're, God! We're done with uh, <laughs> Sonic's first stage, Shadow's first stage, the two driving stages, but we're back to Tails with Mission Street, because we're going to do our first shooting stage and see how these work. Okay, cool. They kind of work the same, pretty much. You know, I just realized, whenever, uh, whenever there's a level of my Let's Play or yours, uh... The opposing party, whenever we get to, like, a boring-ass level, we always, like, honk like a goose whenever it starts up. So, I, that's just a little little something honk, I noticed. Honk like a goose? What? Gah! There's, there's something close <laughs> to that. It's just a, a, a sound of distress, as you will, and the, that's the first thing I could think of was just, like, ah! <laughs> I'm sorry, that's just that's uh, my small observation for this episode. I will see myself out. It's been fun! See you in the next episode. Well, uh, welcome back to Let's Play Sonic Adventure 2, uh, starring UDJ. <laughs> I completely forgot you had codes on. <laughs> Was that part of the code? Uh, this isn't, but it looks like it, doesn't it? Because the boosters act as like a hovering jet, so you just kind of go up from there. But yeah, no. Oh, See, God. You say codes, I say modifications. They say break with the missile, but you know what? I'm not going to be playing by their rules. I've got better plans. And that was... Was that a moon jump? That was a moon jump. Okay. So we still got moon jump, we still got speed on, if that's not obvious, or if you missed the past four episodes. <laughs> yeah, coming in at episode 26 of Sonic Adventure 2. <laughs> I want to see how far they get in these, these A ranks. What, they're cheating? What bullshit? I'm going to go do it myself. Come back. You'll be, mere you'll be back then. Yeah, he'll be back. Yeah, it's just, it's the, just the common thing. You'll be back. You'll see. <laughs> I'm, I'm very glad that people aren't angry at using the action. <laughs> right. They're going, what? What the hell, UDJ? This isn't the pro gameplay I was expecting. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, I told, yeah, pro, uh, yeah, yeah, pro right, gameplay. <laughs> that could be said for both of us. <laughs> because we got the uh, steel crate breaker, we can do that and get that random ass chocobo. I guess. Cool. By the way, I haven't asked in a while, but uh, was there another item for Tails to get? Yeah, there is, but it's not here. Oh, okay. And you'll point that out, right? Because I noticed a lot of people were asking, well, can you at least show where those items were? I did point out where um, Shadow's <laughs> flame bracelet was, but in City Escape, there was actually an item for Sonic that I didn't show. <gasps> How could you? In the... In the place right after this scripted event where you're running down the, you're running down the building, you'll see four steel crates. I'm going to show it here, obviously. Oh. You, break the, you break that, and that's how you get the magic hands. The magic hands are useless and dumb and stupid. Okay. Now I got it for, like... It's so you can put enemies into a ball, but why would you want to ever put enemies in a ball when you Wait. can just homing attack them? Wait, seriously? You just... It, like, you crumple them up like a piece of paper? So you can pick them up and throw them at other enemies. There's no... That serves no point. That sounds so stupid, though. It is. I did it, Sonic. Okay. If oh, that was close. That it, was close. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You almost didn't have it. Your your uh, total score is going to into the E. And I was just thinking, how mad would you be if it actually got to that final score ranking, and because you didn't have like enough rings or something, it didn't give you the A? Well, speaking of enough rings, we're gonna have that problem because this is the hundred rings for. Mission Street. And there's not very many rings in Mission Street. How many are there? There are about 118. Alright! <laughs> Which means that we have to be very, very particular, very, very precise about getting these next few rings. We gotta make sure we don't get hit, we gotta make sure we go relatively fast because we're still in a time limit here for the A ranks. Still no low time code. I turned that off for this, as you can see, on the last episode. But we gotta do everything pretty much exactly if we want to make sure that we get 100 rings in time. With codes, that's only mildly easier. <laughs> T to date, to date, this is what's give this is this mission right here is what's giving me the most problems. Uh oh. Right now. Oh my god. Yep. And so, well, might as well just go ahead and restart. Can somebody make an make an animated GIF of Tails moon jumping? It makes it look like it makes it look like his walker is like trying its best to find a stair. 
or something like that. It's just, it's trying to be an animal it clearly isn't. Be yeah, it's trying to do an animation it's not clearly supposed to do. It's still, <laughs> it's still jumping, it's still reaching height, but it's not, it's not looping correctly enough or something. It, it's like I kind of feel sorry for it, and it's like, oh, oh, no, no, Mac, oh, come, here, come here, hon, let, let me... Let me show you a double barrel shotgun here. One thing you're also noticing is that my lock on is changed. I just, I just uh, remember this. But whenever I lock on, a laser fires. Whoa. That's another power up that we get a little later, a little later on, though. Oh, okay. So it's, it's basically. It's a fire before the actual firing. Yeah. Okay. It's like when you lock on, you don't throw a missile or whatever. You throw just a big, huge laser that really, really hurts. Oh, I love this camera angle. Oh, yeah. Also worth mentioning, you know how Eggman got the protective armor? Yeah. You're thinking, where's Tails, right? Oh, no. Tails don't get none. Mm. The reason because being he's... is because, because uh, the leaders of Team Dark and Team Hero get an extra item. Everybody has four items, but... Uh, uh, everyone else just gets four because the, 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 the leaders get five. That's what I'm trying oh. to say. So Eggman gets an extra item, which is that protective armor, and Sonic gets that extra extra item, which is the bounce bracelet. Shadow doesn't bounce. Oh, yeah. I guess we never did see him bounce because he's too busy being edgy. White men can't jump. Black hawks can't bounce. <laughs> it's either that or they don't want to. It's like I'm not gonna do that, honky. <laughs> edgy. No, so, sorry, excuse me. Y yes, the, the proper slang is edgy. All right, so we're, we've got 87. We're about there. I think the le the limit is like 2 minutes 20 seconds. Because you kind of got to go through like most of the level to get most of the rings. You yeah, be yeah. very careful that that ah! doesn't happen. Ah! 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 Yeah, I just might as well just run straight into an earthquake. Earthquake! Earthquake! <laughs> there is oh, an earthquake occurring. God, that, yeah, that that imagery just makes me laugh a lot. Just seeing Tails, the way he deals with grief is jumping into tectonic plates and just completely <laughs> offing himself. It Sonic, hilarious. I don't have the will to live anymore. <laughs> I'm going to jump into, a, into the San Andreas Fault. <laughs> Way to go, Tails! Like, as soon as he sees any crevice that's, like, a hundred feet or more deep, he just goes, Well, I'm done. See you later. Like, it's like it's an impulse. Like, it's just <laughs> yeah. like, uh... uh Alright, uh, so, uh, I've modified the tornado that uh, has a higher takeoff speed, and when the landing gear is, it's like, Oh, it's crevice! Oh, goodbye, cruel world! But it doesn't fit. <laughs> so anyway, uh, to work the landing gear, you gotta pull this lever, but make sure that you're at least a hundred feet off the air. Yeah, it has to... Yeah. Like, it, it is totally immediate, just because he loves it so much. He loves the thrill, but every time he... It's like he's he's scared of his own hobby. It's just like, oh, God, I love doing this, but I, I, just, I just can't do it. So he always thinks he's going to die as soon as he goes jumping off. Hanging out with that Sonic boy has ruined that young Miles boy. <laughs> he used to be such a good little child, but now all he does is just jump around and... Shoot things! And, do, do, you know, oh do you know those uh, those like cop shows where, where they always have that one that one person who says they always used to be such a good boy, but then they turn bad. It's kind of like one of those where the police are interviewing somebody and they're like, "But Tails used to be a good boy. He never used to be a thrill seeker." I just gotta see Lenny and Briscoe just grilling the fuck out of Tails. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> God, I can see this it now. Just saying, Tails, Miles, son, we know what you did. So where's Shade's body, hmm? She was only in one game, and we haven't seen her since. You're the last one we've seen her with. And we also got some questions about this Cosmo lady. I'm just thinking, Miles, it, if it had to be anybody, why not Charmy? Why didn't you go after them? Alright, I think I just had enough time. I think it was 2.30, actually. Was, hey, hey, still hey, look at that! Again, not very many rings, so you gotta go through the entire level just to get them and be very particular and uh, not fun. Huh. But hey, back to fun. 
Because we're going to go to find the Lost Chow. And we actually okay. saw where the Lost Chow was a little earlier. Accidentally, because we can jump higher than <laughs> everybody can reasonably jump high. Anyway. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's he's inside the earthquake. I'm going in. Woo! <laughs> earthquake, I'm fucking there, Sonic. <laughs> well, no, no wonder he's got, like, this thrill-seeker attitude. He named his plane the Tornado. He just loves natural disasters. He loves them so much. Really, he just wants to be a storm chaser. <laughs> you know, when, when this whole, like, supersonic speed thing Oops. doesn't work. Oh, outside the barrier. That was a kill plane. Yeah. I, I, do I, I, I do love the sped up walk cycle when you're running fast, though. Uh... <laughs> I'm just waiting for the bass to drop whenever you speed up his walk cycle. <laughs> I gotta play like a dubstep thing every time he just <laughs> zips forward. Yeah, just, just all of a sudden, whenever you start speeding up, Skrillex starts playing, you get the wub wub going, and then all of a sudden he just stops. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, no, not the rings. <laughs> Please. No, no. Luckily, I, uh, you don't have to worry about rings. You just got to worry about health, which can be a right ass sometimes. Yeah, so, I can right. imagine. So, yeah, back here is the... Whoa! Oh. Back... Whoa! Oh. Right here is the Mystic Melody place, where we just go ahead and just play with that. It takes us up here. But that's just right on top of the... Wait, we've been here. Huh. Oh, shit. Doesn't seem that difficult. Whoa, camera. camera. God, I love this camera angle. Um. Oh, and, uh, what? Uh, oh, uh, shit! Uh, uh, crap. Uh, luckily, we're at a checkpoint, though, so that's alright. Even though you were able to save it, you still went past the kill barrier. You're gonna see that a lot in this game. Just, <laughs> you know, if I just go a place again doesn't want me to, I'm just dead. It's kind of like that, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, you shouldn't be there. See, if Tails has a tornado, he should be able to do this without cheats, you know? I mean, it's a plane! Are you chastising Tails for you using cheats? I'm, well, me using cheats for everybody else is, you know, one thing, but... <laughs> this is a walker, okay? He, you know, you can just add in boosters and all that shit to make him do all the stuff that you can actually replay legitimately. Like I said, it was a plane that it was based on. So I gotta do this ridiculously difficult uh, platforming section, but fuck that, there's the chow. I did it! I'm just thinking Tails was very influenced by him finally being able to watch TV, and he, you know, he's flipping through channels, and all of a sudden Voltron comes on, and he's like, I want to do that! <laughs> dun, dun, da -da, dun, da -da. Go watch Voltron Legendary Defender. Totally not a paid it's advertisement. Not a sponsored video. That, no, it really, is, it, it, it really isn't. Go fucking see it because I told you to. It's good. You'll love it. I promise. All right, time attack now. Go as fast as we can. Three and a half minutes. Not a lot of time. And here we see Supersonic Tails. Just yet. Well, that was absolutely wrong. But here we see Storm Chaser Tails as he attempts to dive into a hurricane face first to see if he can survive the action. More details at, at seven. Look, look. You don't see this on the back, but that was like clipping into the wall there. Did you see it? Whoa, whoa. Well, you just clipped through the floor. Wait, you said so, so, so many so, so many cool things you didn't notice about this game that you can only find through action replay, you know? Oh, oh whoa. <laughs> like the game actively trying to bat you down like the fly that you are. <laughs> you annoying pest. I could tell you're using action replay and you're dead, aren't you? Nope. Wow! Whoa. You were like miles away. How did you not go past the kill zone? Sometimes it's at certain places. Sometimes it isn't. Like, like well, sometimes I swear that's where a kill plane should be, but yeah. it isn't. And sometimes, why the fuck is there a, cl a kill plane right there? I'm just thinking, why the hell are there explosive barrels all over the street? Th that's an Eggman thing, isn't it? Oh. Ah. Oh. I let too much health get away from me. Jeez. I thought we were watching expert gameplay. <laughs> when did you think that? 
See, I was just thinking all that flying you were doing, that was the result of, like, flipping the stick back and forth to make it so you don't lose your flying, and you're... Dude, okay. 26 episodes, you think this is gonna get some expert gameplay going on in here? <laughs> okay, good point. Have you <laughs> seen expert gameplay up until now? Uh, well, well, you know, you showed it off for, for, like, the little guy. It's like somebody who just got Sonic Adventure 2 in friggin' 2016. And you're just going, okay, so here's how you do the level normally. Now let's get nuts. Well, have you played Sonic Adventure 2? Uh, no. So this is just perfect for you, isn't it? Yes, it is. You're showing me, you're showing me the calm, like, like, uh, exquisite gamer side, and then you're showing me the uh, breaking the game on holy, <laughs> on holy, ungodly playthrough version. See, my philosophy is that that's what games should be. It should be hard first, but then when you beat it and do everything, it should be like, you know, crazy go nuts fun, like a reverse difficulty curve. I can agree with that. Not a, instead of making your player play the same stage five times and try and get A ranks arbitrarily for no fucking reason. If I didn't have to get all A ranks, we wouldn't be doing action replay. You know that? The only reason we're doing this is because we need all fucking A ranks. So that's bullshit. You know what game? It just reminded me of your little rant there about having the player play the game over and over again. Sonic Heroes? No, it actually has nothing to do with Sonic. You remember Ninja Gaiden 2? Like, the newer one? Oh, yeah. Did you ever look at the achievement list? Yeah. Beat the entire game with this weapon, five gamer score. Beat the entire game with this weapon, five gamer score. Oh, that's, well, that's basically that's... playing through the entire game 12 times. Just for probably a grand total of less than 60 gamer score. So this is interesting. I can't get through because there's cages here. I can't break cages, so what do I... How do I get... Oh, steel one. There. Oh, hard mode. Hashtag hard mode. <laughs> Hashtag help! <laughs> we'll head to the chow world after this, too. I'm just thinking hard mode replaces all the platforms with, like, insta-death spikes and... You actually have to use the jet boosters to get around everywhere because the level's just so hard. This is hard mode, not 1993 mode. Oh, true, true. I long for the game. I long for the days where games were hard but fun. Yeah, not even Dark Souls would be that hard. Sheesh. <laughs> it's like, whoa, slow down Sonic Adventure 2. <laughs> Dark Souls, you know what I'm saying? Wouldn't that be interesting, though, if... Sonic, if this game was reworked as Dark Souls, so so when you die, you have to you have to start back at the last checkpoint or bonfire and get your rings back. If you die again, well, you lose it forever. <laughs> it would ah! make it. It would. Oh Jesus! It would make it a lot more dramatic. I could see that, especially when you go supersonic and all of a sudden you're losing all your rings and you gotta go get them back. You gotta beat Sin before you can get your stuff back. Sin. Don't you Whatever. bring no Final Don't bring no Final Fantasy X into my shit. Look, Sin was probably the most interesting part of that game, I certainly wasn't Titus. It was just it was just his dad. Ooh, big deal. Whoa, whoa. Hey, spoilers, bro. Yeah, spoilers on a shit Final Fantasy game. Yeah, I did <laughs> y'all a favor. No, how could you? Why? Now, because that was hard mode, I did the mystical melody thing, and I played it, and it warped me actually backwards. Yeah, I noticed that. That is so jerky. So, so I'm thinking, okay, what's at the place where the lost Chow is then? Nothing. All right, I thought there'd be something there, like you know, an extra one up or something crazy. Because th these levels are a lot more explorative than you may think. Like, <laughs> Turns like out I just. <laughs> they just fly around sometimes, like, oh, I didn't know that was there. I was like, oh, I didn't know this, this was there. It turns out they replaced the Lost Chow with a, with a sign that just says, <laughs> you were expecting Sonic Adventure 3? There we go, there's the cameo. There's the Easter egg. Not gonna let that go, are we? <laughs> I'm just waiting for it. Because during that Sonic livestream, people were asking, when Sonic Adventure 3? And the creator was like, uh, no, no, not yet. Um, probably never, but I didn't actually say it that way. But uh, anyway... It, well, probably not because people are into generations now instead of adventure, because, you know, yeah. Last you time know, I tried to make Adventure 3, it turned out to be Sonic Unleashed. Well, you know what? 
if Sonic Generations is the closest we're going to get to a Sonic Adventure 3, I'll take it. I'll take a million actually, of it. Actually, Sonic Unleashed is the closest thing we're going to get to Sonic Adventure 3, because that started as Sonic Adventure 3. All right, burn it all down. Yeah, burn it all down. All of it. Because we're going to do the Chow world now. Cause... And then have Tails jump into a volcano because he's a thrill seeker. We're also going to see Tails do some fun action replay stuff in here. Because he doesn't have the walker in here, so we can do some fun stuff. Oh, please go so fast that you clip through the walls. Haven't gone that fast. Darn it. These these walls are pretty solid. Haven't been able to escape yet. Darn it. I've tried, I've tried in the gardens too, mine. Hey, I just so realized something. Uh, this is, sorry to interrupt, but uh, okay, why okay. are there Japanese characters in the top right? When you when you just enter the shop, because it looks cool and probably it's in the they probably had oh shit whoops whoa oh right maybe I should mention one of the other codes that I uh, put in <laughs> size dude <laughs> hey you know, Digime. Yeah, we'll have a little bit of, uh, size fun, a little bit of size play. Yeah, sure. Oh, jeez. I have a map to the D-pad. Uh, D up makes you grow, D down makes you shrink, D left brings you back to normal. Oh, God, that's great. We'll be having some more fun with that later. Guaranteed. Hey, Shithy. Uncle Tails is here to play. You know, in all seriousness, being small in the Chow world makes it a bit easier to maneuver. You know, I can see everything clearly. I can just go ahead and pick up. I, I checked. No, you don't drown. Darn it. Yeah, because it still considers your sprite above water. Damn. Yeah. I don't think you can drown in these levels anyway. Can you imagine if... Oh, your, your little chows. You know, so, somebody's coming to visit your chows. Like, the teachers from the preschool just come around. And all they see is, like, a floating fox boy just in the water, face down. That's been there. <laughs> Sorry. Ah. Oh, now he's the perfect puntable size in comparison to Tails. So there is a max height that we can go here, so... Oh, God. Again, really good on invisible walls, this place. Can't really escape. Oh, wait. What's he do? Oh, he's so fucking smart! Oh! He just saw that fucking fruit and says, Ah, that's something I want. And he went for it. Good on you, Deji May, you little motherfucking piece of shit, you. So Chow's eventually learn what the good stuff is. If I, I gotta take him to school more. Because it turns out, to get the emblems, we're gonna have to start getting these motherfuckers smart. I'm just thinking, yeah, he's he's smart enough to know what food is, but as far as, like, basic living, you know, he's he's probably not that smart. Yeah, he'll, he's still a baby, after all. I mean, so, yeah. It's... Still? God, this yeah. Let's Play's been going on for, like, ten years, and he's still a baby? How about that long, jeez. <laughs> I'm kidding. But hey, it's gonna get ten years, because we have still more A-ranks and still more Chow stuff to do. Alright, woo! Yeah, yeah. You, you better, you better get excited. I can't wait for those space levels with Knuckles and Rouge! Oh, I bet you can't. Oh god, see, those sound awesome! See, I'm still moving above water, so it still considers me above water. So, hey, the drowning thing doesn't work, so... There's that. Can, can you still add the, the old-fashioned tone, as if you're drowning? Okay, we'll close out with that. Tails, no. 